I just wanted to give you guys a really quick tour of your new website for the OFA. Uh, it's been a while since you've had an update, so I uh, just wanted to show you around a little bit. And also, I would love to hear what you think about the new website and anything that you see that needs to be changed, modified, fixed, whatever. Uh, it is a brand new site, so chances are there will be something. So uh, you get to the site the same way you always have, ofainc.com. Uh, what you see on the site, uh, you can scroll downwards, you can use the tabs, other things like that. So it's all uh, very, very simple. Uh, if you ever want to get back to the home page, just click the upper left logo. Uh, this is always visible, this menu and, and the header here. So what we have on the menu, events, news, members, contact, and payments, uh, which is hopefully what you would expect to see. Uh, the only event we have right now, of course, the annual meeting in Oklahoma City, uh, October 25th. So if you click through to that, you'll see that, um, you know, some of the details about that, and we'll be adding details as uh, the planning progresses. So. Uh, we'll be staying at the Hampton Inn and Suites. I'm looking forward to meeting you there and telling you all about uh, some of the marketing that we're doing for, for OFA. You can also add it to your calendar uh, using the blue button down here or share uh, information about that event to your favorite social media using these buttons here. So um, hopefully that is self-explanatory. Uh, we also have news. Uh, which will take you to member highlights and uh, things like the, the new website, you know, things like this video, uh, member benefits and other things go on the news page. Also, member news we want to include as well. So we'd love to hear news about your organization, if you've hired anybody, if you have uh, a charity event or something like that coming up. If you have news that you'd like to share with your fellow OFA members, we'd love to include it here. Um, all right, under members, this is a directory uh, that you can search geographically. So you can just click on people and uh, find out more about them. Uh, you can also search for people. Um, I highly recommend that you search for your own name, especially. Um, Mark is somebody that I just worked on his profile. So I know he's got uh, some information in there. Um, if I click on his profile, I'm going to see a category. I'm going to see some information, uh, contact information, website, Twitter, Facebook, and so on. And then you can include quite a bit in your profile. You can include links to a podcast or uh, links to articles that you've written, links to other things that you've done. You can include photos. Uh, it shows a map of where you are. Uh, there's a section for reviews so that uh, members can review one another. If someone has really impressed you, you might want to write about them uh, in that section. Uh, under contact, we have a contact form for, or to join the mailing list. And then we also have a new member application if somebody wants to, to join. They have uh, a lot of questions so that the leadership can evaluate that person's qualifications uh, for membership. So they can submit it right here on the website. Uh, also under payments, you can submit your dues. Just click the blue button and that will take you to a Stripe uh, checkout section. You just indicate how many people you're paying dues for, probably just one. Um, click checkout and then enter your information here just as you would if you were shopping online for books at Amazon or whatever the situation is. So that's just a, a plain credit card processing uh, program called Stripe that is integrated with the account. Um, so hopefully it's really simple to use. Once again, if I wanna get back to the homepage, I just click the link in the upper left-hand corner one more thing is we do have links to our social media. So if I click uh, LinkedIn here, it will take us to our LinkedIn page. So this takes you to uh, the OFA's LinkedIn page. And LinkedIn, of course, being social media, it is a great way to get to know other members. You can click the little bell here and it will let you know. Uh, you can choose all posts, 
top posts or, uh, you know, only posts involving you. So I'm just going to say, I want to be informed about everything on this page. Um, since I'm doing your social media, I suppose I should do that, right? Uh, and then I can comment or post my own uh, posts on, on this page. So, uh, you know, wrong way Corrigan post, I can uh, add a photo or something like that and say, hey, you know, if it wasn't for my instructor, I'd probably be going the wrong way anyway. Um, so you can go ahead and add comments, you can share, you can repost to your own page, you can send this to other people to let them know, hey, something funny is going on. Uh, on this this site uh, or something cool is going on or something that you should know about. So all of those things are, um, you know, great things to do with, with any social media. And I'm going to go ahead and click the um, upper left-hand corner to go back to the homepage. And thank you for joining me for this real quick tour of your new website. I hope you enjoy it. Once again, I'm fully expecting that there are going to be things that don't make everybody 100% happy. Uh, and there are going to be things that we need to fix over the next little while. So the more eyes we get on it, the better. And I really appreciate your help. Uh, let me know what you see that you'd like to see different. And uh, we'll get those uh, added, changed, adjusted. And this page will be growing along with the organization, uh, hopefully for a very long time. Talk to you soon.